I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> This is your girl Alyssa, the Curvy Curlista. And if you're new here, welcome. And if you're not new here, welcome back. So for today's video, I will be showing you how I achieved this juicy wet look. It didn't take that long to do this, but I love it. I love it. I love it. So if you love it too, stay tuned so you can see how to do it. All right, so I'm back. I shampooed my hair, did my makeup real quick, cause it's about to be a look. <laughs> my hair is wet this is what it looks like after I shampoo y'all know that so let me give you the backstory about this wet look and why I want to do it so in my video where I was testing the magnetic eyelash strips I had already done my hair in a wet style and I was thinking about showing y'all how I did it but then I started seeing that it's been trending the wet look so today we're just gonna do the wet look challenge and next time I'll do my wet look give you a little spin So first, I'm going to spray my hair again. Just lightly spray it. And it does have to be wet to accomplish this look. Next, I'm gonna use the base of any of my hairstyles that I do. And that is my Oye Day Daily Moisture Cream. And with this, I like to focus from mid shaft to ends, just to protect and hydrate my hair. And I'm about to put these products on. Next, I'm going to use my main choice leave-in. Well, this is a multi-use conditioner. I already demoed it and how to use it in the different ways. But this is from the Exotic Coolet Collection. I'm use about that much. We want to put this from root to ends. I always start from the center because that's where my hair tends to be dry. I'm gonna add some more. Next, I'm gonna be using my Denim brush. I'm going to detangle my hair again and evenly distribute the product into my hair. For my west side, I want a slightly center part, so I'm gonna brush it to the sides. You see we are already kind of looking like the look. I'm gonna add a little more water in the back. Next, I'm going to be using my definition of definition jello, also by main choice. This does smell so good. I'm gonna use my this much for all of my hair. Starting from the ends and working my way up. I'm going to finger comb this through. Last product, I'm gonna use my Nairobi Rapid Shine Foaming Lotion. Use plenty of it because it's gonna be the additional hold and smoothing of this style. Start from the roots. Work my way down, get the back real good, where it's thick at. <laughs> now we're going to finger comb this through again. And turn around so you see the back. Make sure that you don't have any separations in the back. And the important part about this style is clumping your curls together. Lastly, I'm gonna lay my edges down. And it doesn't have to be like a hard hold, but just enough to where it's not frizzy. See that? And I'm just using the same curl defining jelly. So it's gonna wave up actually but as long as it's not frizzy, I'm cool with it. A little more foam, just to smooth that out right there. So 
these colorful flowers. I'll be back. I'm back. I'm back. This is so cute. I'm gonna add these little clip accessories. <laughs> so this is super cute. This is my wet look. So for this glowy makeup look, this will be my next video. I'll be wearing the same thing because I did it in the same day. Okay? So don't cover me. <laughs> but this hair is so cute. I think this is perfect for date night, a stroll in the park. <laughs> to a party, to the club, wherever you want to go. And it'll dry just like this. As long as you don't touch it, it'll look just like this all day. So this was your girl, Alyssa. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Go ahead and make sure you're subscribed and thumbs up this video so I know if you want some more hair videos. <laughs> this was your girl, Alyssa, the Curvy Curlisa. Thank you for watching and I will see you in my next video.